Hello and welcome to My Secret Math Tutor. For this video, we're going to calculate the five number summary using a Casio FX 115ES Plus. All right, so this is a wonderful little calculator uh, that does a lot of different things uh, and it can especially do a few of our statistical things. So we're going to try and get our data into this calculator and then calculate the minimum, the first quartile, the median, the third quartile, and the maximum. All right, so let's get on to step one, getting that data into the calculator. To do that, you want to press your shift and the number one to go into your stat and distribution. Number two is where we can actually store in our data. So let's go ahead and press that. And now you just want to enter in each of these values one at a time. I'll go ahead and speed up the video so you're not uh, waiting around, but let's get them all in there. All right, looks like we have all 12 of the uh, data values in there. Now it's time to get on to the next step. From here, you want to press the all clear button but don't worry, everything is still in the calculator. We just need to get back to our screen so that we can get into those menus where we're doing the minimum and these quartiles, all right? So now that we're back on our main screen here, press Shift-1. And number six is where you'll find all of these values. So let's go six where it says min-max. And there's our five uh, number summary. Now, you actually have to do one of these at a time. You can't just do all of them on the screen all at once. So let's go ahead and go down this list and grab them all. So the first one of these, we'll grab the minimum value. That's number one. You'll see we've uh, been put back on the main screen. Now I can press enter, and it'll give us that minimum value, which is, of course, the five. So we'll just go ahead and put that in there. Now I need more of them, so let's go ahead and press the shift and then number one again. That was the min-max, number six. And now we'll go into the third option for the th first quartile. So that goes back on the home screen, press enter. You can see that that's 35 and a half. So you're really just going to repeat this process for all the rest. Shift, one, min-max. Now we're looking for the median. That's listed as number four. Sounds good, 47. Min max, yes. Third quartile, all right. 63. And one last one. Min max. Uh, this one we want the max, so that's number two. And we have 80. All right, so just like that, you have all the five numbers for your five number summary. Of course, these correspond to the minimum, first quartile, the median, third quartile, and the maximum. So if you're making something like a box plot, Right? If you'd like to see some more videos, please visit MySecretMathTutor.com. 